Today, we will talk about five foods that form mucus. So if you're interested, stay tuned and learn the foods that could cause disease and sickness in your body. So you may want to stay away from these type foods. I know, I know, that went very fast. And I know that we love these foods, but we don't have to eat these foods all the time, especially if we feel sick. So just slow down eating red meat, because red meat is high in protein, and it can lead to excess accumulation of mucus in our bodies and make our sinuses worse. So let me be clear, because any type of meat, including chicken, could cause mucus in our body. So let's slow it down. Yum, yum. Who doesn't love cheese? This is a hard one, because some people say dairy products does not cause mucus, and other people say dairy products cause mucus. However, there was a survey taken, and you can research this yourself, and the people who had the cow's milk, this is what they said. They said they found it harder to swallow, and their saliva was thicker, and that they could feel a coating in their throat. So, I'm going to say, you be the judge on this one, and put your findings after you eat some dairy products, put your findings in the comment section below. Now, I don't drink cow's milk, so I drink hemp seed milk, and I will link my hemp seed recipe in this uh, video for anyone who wants to make their own hemp seed milk. Now, I love bananas. But bananas increase the histamine levels in our bodies. So once the histamine levels are increased, that makes more mucus. So it's not only bananas, it's bananas, it's strawberries, it's pineapples, it's papaya, it's eggs, and it is pasta. They all can increase our histamine levels. So we don't want to eat in excess of these type of foods. Oh my, it's fast foods. Yes, fast foods can produce mucus in our bodies. So we don't want to have fast foods every day, but it's okay to go out and have every once in a while whatever fast food we love. Don't forget to subscribe and to ring that bell for notifications when I upload and share this video and thumbs up or like this video. And we'll see you all in the next lesson. Shalom, shalom, family.